So my baby has been sick and I find that the best way to get the snot out of his nose is to suck it out with my mouth. Yes, this works wonders. Don't mind the mask on my face. I've been doing my little skincare routine. He really doesn't like his nose being touched at all and I just don't have time to fight with him. Here is his nose after, all clean. And we're gonna follow up with some saline drops and elderberry for him to drink. And I have a baby medicine bottle that he holds and that also works wonders as you can see and now we're gonna add his saline drops in his nose and there we go happy baby good job papa why am i crying why am i a sweetheart why have i a heart of gold and why do i let people in as it was fucking up to do If I was ugly, like these people are claiming that I am, then how the hell I keep getting all the guys that I want? Any guy that I want. I could really get any guy that I want. Why? I was trying to show you how to Why would you bring that up here? I was trying to show you Take it back outside, man. Just yell from down there, we'll come to the window. Dash, get in. How many layers of duct tape does it take to stop that bus? Here's one layer, okay? Now let's try five layers. Come on, bus! Come on! Easy! Let's try ten layers. <laughs> 20 more, and it's game over. Really? Yep. 25 layers. Come on! Oh! 50 layers. If he breaks through this, you have to subscribe. Come on. That's so many layers. Oh, oh, oh. What about 100? 100 layers. Go. 100 layers. The bus is unstoppable. My life, my rules. My style, my attitude. You love me or hate me, I don't care. But don't play with me. Right, right. Well, she, he, uh huh. Well, she, he. His pronouns are he, him. Now, are you going to respect that, or is this they, them going to turn you into a war was? Hi, guys. So, I have a question for all you men out there. This is for all you men out there. I have a question for all you men. Um, why do you got? Why do you men always have to be so complicated? when uh, uh you like a girl why do you gotta be so complicated why not just tell her how you feel instead of hiding your feelings why you gotta be so complicated please please answer my question a guy on here please if you're a guy and watching this please answer this question why do you guys have to be so complicated why do men have to be so complicated that you like like a when you like a girl that's my question for the day if anyone if any men can answer that please i want to know imagine taking a photo of a guy doing deadlifts in the middle of a crosswalk then getting upset when someone crosses the street oh you're influencing yeah the only thing you're influencing is natural selection why don't you stay there a little longer let it do its job yeah then you got this one thinks the world is an amusement park <laughs> There you go. That's how you got to treat these people. Just push them to the side. Yeah, let's take selfies with wild bears now. Why not? Look at her shocked. Who do you think it was going to stand up, put its arm around you, and make duck lips for your Snapchat? Then you got this one, taking a photo with her entire identity. God, they're everywhere. Ugh. How about you really try to live a life without seeking validation? What is this shit? I don't think this guy needs a photo, honey. I'm thinking more of an exorcism. Well, this is the world we live in now, folks. The look at me generation, where everyone finds a way to make everything about themselves and make sure you see it. What a legacy to leave behind. Love her.
felt beautiful until the age of 12 when my body began to ripen like new fruit. And suddenly, the men looked at my newborn hips with salivating lips. The boys, they didn't want to play tag at recess. They wanted to touch all the new and unfamiliar parts of me. The parts I didn't know how to wear, didn't know how to carry, tried to bury in my ribcage. Boobs, they said. And I hated that word hated that I was embarrassed to say it that even though it was referring to my body it didn't belong to me it belonged to them and they repeated it like they were meditating upon it boobs he said let me see yours if Proho were to take an empty water bottle and fill it up halfway with black oil based paint then add a little used motor oil and for good measure, a few pinches of sand, and then stretch a water balloon over the opening. And then lob this party favor, or let's say an occupying force. Goodness, that oil-based paint is difficult to deal with, hard to wash off. And that oil, well, it's slippery too. And the sand, goodness, it plays havoc on face shields. Not so good for optics either. Act accordingly. I can buy myself flowers. I can buy myself flowers. <laughs> okay. I can buy myself flowers. Bitch, I went to the flowers. Sensei Ledoux do hereby take you, Misa Ackerman, to be my lawfully wedded wife, offering you both my oath and my blade. I shall be your loyal servant, and you, my ever elegant Khaleesi. Your turn, Mikasa. Hmm. For those who could not understand, Mikasa has chosen to recite her vows in her native tongue of Japanese. Needless to say, her words were beautiful. What's that, Levi? I may now kiss the bride. Gladly. Mwah. Thank you all for coming. I hope you will all join us for a tendy platter or two at the reception at Applebee's.
I will get the problem solved and I will get it solved in rapid order. And it will take me no longer than one day. I know exactly what to say to each of them. I got along with very well with them. Our manager? Okay. Because it's so tight. They started here. You can finish that part. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I I came around and I was like, hey, what can I do for you? Okay. Usually it's like like a, the price is wrong or whatever. Yeah. She starts going on this, this spiel about uh, like... Your about how like I've had a privileged yeah. life and she's been disadvantaged and then said that she was asking Target to make reparations for her. And I said, that's not something we can do tonight. If like if you need a donation, like you can call tomorrow, I can put you in touch like, with the HR person, but like, that isn't something I can do for you like right now tonight. Okay. And then she like she was like, You need to put me in touch with someone tonight. And I was like, I can't. There isn't like yeah. So, like, she just basically just kept saying that. And then she got really close to me. Mm -hmm. So I put my hands up and backed up, and she, like, followed me. She was, like, like breathing into my eyeballs. Was she screaming at you? Or... Yeah. So she got really close to me. I put my hands up. I touched her shoulders because she was, like, coming into my space. Okay. Um, and then she, like... Because I touched her, she like went to the unit after that and just no started screaming request. really loudly and like backing up against the soda machine. Okay. And then that's when like our security person, yeah, he called, she called our security person mm -hmm. and he came over and like intervened. So, what caused the issue down here today? Because I came in, uh, actually, Target is somewhat of a home for me. And we were going to have a big discussion here, and I asked them to do it nicely. Who are you going to have this big discussion with? With Target, wherever in Target I needed to speak with. What were you asking her to do? Reach out to her manager so we can have a larger discussion about how money works, and how provision works, and how it's been working in our community for a very long way. Can you elaborate a little bit, go into further detail? Sure. I was asking for the support of my community to come behind me in a big way to have a money conversation. There are more people subjugated and locked out of things. We have decided we were not going to have a bigger conversation. I decided to take a stand. This is my Rosa Parks moment, dude. Don't play with me. I'm just listening. That's all I'm doing. We're having a conversation about how to reconcile the fact that some people benefited off of a system that was great against other people. I asked nicely to have that conversation. Okay, what were you asking for? To talk to, for her to connect me with who I could talk to. What was your purpose of that, con that further conversation? What were you going to ask that person for to do? To break the lies around money. What's that mean? We all know money has not been treating everybody equally. Okay. Money is not the only way for things to happen. It's were, you, not, were you asking for them to make a donation, essentially? Or to let you have them for free? No, what was it? I was coming up to the limit of where I had money. I was trying to ask if Target would comp me the rest and we would have a conversation, a bigger bubble up a bigger conversation about why because I know the heart of this place. Okay. It's the right place for me to have this conversation. Yeah, Target's a good company. Exactly. Yeah. And I was trying to have a hard conversation in a safe place. Yeah. Okay. So did you um, No, 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 no. I got out there, People I, I hit like me for that. I did it the right way. And then when I, was I went through the right steps. So they kept the reason the problem why money doesn't work right is because it blocks people at checkpoints. And I'm tired of you locking good people out. You don't get paid what you deserve. Nearly as 